welcome back. My name is David Bombal, CCIE 11023. In this video I want to show you how to record conversations by using the built-in Cisco Unity Connection feature Live Record. Live Record is another great feature built into Cisco Unity Connection. This allows users to record their conversations. Recorded conversations are stored as a voicemail message in the user mailbox. Users can forward the message to other users. This is great because as an example if I call your phone and we want to have a record of the conversation we can get Unity Connection to record the conversation and then I could email you a copy of the recording. Essentially the way this works is Unity Connection is conferenced into the call. So when one phone phones another phone we conference Unity Connection in. So it's a three-way call between Unity Connection and our two phones. So it's a great feature within Unity Connection. The first thing we need to do to set this up is create a number within Cisco Unified Communications Manager. So on CUCM go to Call Routing Directory Number Add a new directory number so in this example I'm going to create a directory number of 2130 and then I'm going to send all calls to voicemail. So call forward all to the voicemail system and click save. In Unity Connection we're going to go to call routing and notice here we're going to select forwarded routing rules. At the moment we have attempt forward and opening greeting. So I'm going to click add new. I'll set the name to live record. Click save. We'll make sure that the status is set to active and then scrolling down we're going to send the call to a conversation and the conversation is going to be start live record. I'm going to click save. Now this rule will affect all calls and that's not what we want. We only want to do that for our specific number so I'm going to click add new, set the dialed number equal and once again looking at CUCM notice this number so we're going to set it to the same number as we configured on Cisco Unified Communications Manager and click Save. So let's try that. Here are two phones. I'm going to dial 1001. Answer the call. I'll just mute it. Press More press conference. Select the unity number that we created. S select conference. And notice it says no conference bridge. Now because this is a conference we need to make sure that in CUCM we start the IP Voice Media Streaming app or have a hardware conference bridge available. So under Tools, Service Activation I'm going to enable the Cisco IP Voice Media Streaming app. Click Save. Click OK to the message. So the service is now activated Let's test to see if live record works. So we've got two phones here, 1002 and 1001. Let's set up a call between 1002 and 1001. So there's the call. And now on 1002, I'm going to choose the option conference. And then we're going to conference in the unity number. 
So notice a conference has been established. Now this is difficult because I'm talking to myself and recording myself. But let's end the call and see if we get a copy of this. Notice Sarah gets an MWI notification. So if we go off hook, press the messages button. Enter your PIN followed by pound. Sarah London. Hello. You have one new voice message. To play new messages, press 1. To send a me new messages, message 1 from Sarah London. The notice of conference has been established. Now, this is difficult because I'm talking to myself and recording myself. But let's end the call and see if we get a copy of this. Received today at 9.07 p.m. To repeat, press 1. To save it, to delete it. End of new messages. You so as you can see, the MWI is now set off. So that's how live recording works in a Cisco Unified Communications Manager environment. You are essentially conferencing in Cisco Unity Connection and then Unity Connection is recording whatever it hears. It's a very useful feature built in to Cisco Unity Connection. That concludes this video showing you how to use the built-in feature Live Record in Cisco Unity Connection. Live Record allows users to record conversations by just leveraging features within Cisco Unity Connection. Thank you for watching.